sins. Let me just say something about that, about sin. Because sin is not the different or the, the individual little bitty things or big things that you do wrong in your life. That's not sin. Sin is the total of the nature of you that causes you to do all of those things. Oh God, I wish I had time to preach that. So when God talks about sin, he ain't talking about your murder or your backbiting or your cheating. He doesn't look at them as the individual sins or the individualisms of the wrongs that you commit in your life. When he died on the cross, he died for your sin and sin is the total of the nature that's in you that causes you to do what you do wrong so that if we believe on him that means your past sins your present sins and your future sins are all forgiven if you believe on Jesus Christ but you see if Jesus is in that grave then you are still in your sins what am I saying I'm saying that if there was no resurrection then there is no Savior if there is no Savior then there is no forgiveness of sin if there is no forgiveness of sin there is no justification if there is no justification there is no cleanliness and if there is no cleanliness, that means that the penalty of sin is still on you. That means if the penalty of sin is still on you, then you are on your way to a burning hell. Because you are still in your sins. If Jesus is still in that grave. No wonder the songwriter said, living he loved me. Dying, he saved me. Buried, he carried my sins away. Rising, he justified me. Freed me. Oh, what a wonderful and glorious day. If Jesus is not alive, then sin is sovereign and you are still in your sins, which means you are a sinner and God is holy. And because God is holy, not one fraction of a sin could ever get by him. But thank God today that Jesus is alive. Listen, that simply means to us this morning as I come to my, my next point, that one or two things will have to happen as it relates to sin. It means that your sins will be pardoned in Jesus Christ or your sins will be punished in hell but they will never get by one scripture said your sins will find you out that is if you've not confessed your sins if you've not given Jesus Christ the whole of your heart your sins one day will catch up with you and you're gonna find yourself standing before just God and you're going to have to give an account for all of the deeds that are done in this mortal body. We need you, Lord. We need you, Lord, right now. We need you, Lord. We need you, Lord right now we lift our hands and bow our knees and worship at your throne we need you lord we 